Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So there is a lot of request for students comparing the placements of Siddha Ganga, NI Mysore and BMSIT. So that is what I am going to cover in this particular video. So let me first start with BMSIT, BMS Institute of Technology in Bangalore. This is also an autonomous engineering college. And if you see the number of uh, placements or students who are sitting for placements were 724 on the 21. So you can believe that around 900, 800 to 900 students would have been there on the roll. Out of those 800 to 900 students, 610 got placed with the median salary 4 lakhs, which was quite low. But the next year, 778 were graduating in a minimum time. And that time, 640 students got placed. So that is a similar placement number, 640. Median salary increased to quite good, 6 lakhs. Next year, which is 2023 batch, right, which was the latest placement year, 888 were you know, graduating in the minimum time frame and the number of placements were 741. So there is a big jump of 100 more students got placed. So now placed students are 741. Median salary was 6 lakh. So you can see it has remained, median salary remained constant, but the number of placed students, they tried to place in the recession year was 741 which is called good and uh, NI Mysore so this figure are for NI Mysore and this is based out of Mysore and affiliated to VTU and it's an autonomous college so one of the old and established college they have a good alumni like uh, Naran Murthy who is founder of Infosys and then many others so if you talk about the NRF placement detail for last three years in 2021 uh, passing batch out around 763 students were eligible to sit in the placements and out of that close to 617 students got placed with the median salary of 5.5 lakhs so that is quite decent and uh, next year like the number of students graduating again placed around 712 and out of which 661 students got placed so almost like 40 more students got placed in 2022 and the big jump in the median salary you can see it's like 7.5 lakhs so which is quite excellent and a number of students going for higher studies also reduced to 30 students only and now you see in the next year which is uh, 2023 number of students graduating in a minimum time period was 825 and out of them excellently 788 that is close to 800 students got placed and the median salary again became excellent 7.8 lakh so very close to 8 lakh median salary so that is the update of NI Mysore and quite excellent option for student of Karnataka and they can go for this also. Now the third college on the list which I am talking is Siddh Ganga Institute of Technology or SIT Tumkur and this is also an autonomous college like previous two and this is also available in the similar, similar cutoff ranks like NI Mysore and BMSIT which I discussed earlier right. So if you see now the NIRF data for last three years I will first start with the 2021 batch right like 744 students were uh, graduating in the minimum stipulated time and out of which 723 got placed which is a very good placement and the median salary was already 6 lakhs right and the 2022 batch 855 students were graduating in minimum time period and out of which 831 got placed so which is very high number 800 plus students getting placed with the median salary also increased now to 6.5 lakhs so 50,000 rupees jump in the median salary and if I talk to the net latest placement uh, NIRF data which is available only for 2023 batch so 854 students were eligible for graduating in a minimum stipulated time period and out of which 836 got placed so again it increased further better so almost close to 800 to 850 students are getting placed every year and the median salary you see is now 8 lakhs which is quite excellent so 8 lakh median salary it is competing with all the top 3-4 colleges which are there in Bangalore also so it is one of the top notch option which you should definitely have on the top of the your list right so 8 lakh median salary is quite excellent that's all i have to cover in this video thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on all the colleges in karnataka with respect to nrf placement data and the overall details which i cover across my 
videos. Take care. Bye.